was stuck in a cycle of addiction, self-centeredness, and misery. I had no solution and no idea how to live any other way. My life was a wreck. Then Jesus, working through my wife's empathy, selflessness, and strength, showed up for both of us. When I was at the end of myself and full of desperation, he stepped in to fill the hole in my life that I had always tried to fill with other things. And now I can live in a healthy reality, trusting in God's will, not in my own, knowing that he has a plan for my life better than anything I could have ever dreamed of. I was doubting the Lord in the plan he had for me. As a teenager, I was running as far away from him as I could. One day, I was in a horrible horse accident that left me paralyzed from the waist down. Then, when it looked like I might never walk again, Jesus stepped in and completely healed me. As I was leaving the hospital, I knew that I had to chase him now more than ever. And now I'm alive and I am chasing him and living out my life in his image. I was so overwhelmed and confused following the unplanned divorce from my husband of 43 years. Left alone in a home with no friends or support, I felt unloved and lost. I didn't know where to turn. Then Jesus began pursuing me in ways that I never expected. I felt his grace as my heart began to transform. I finally began to see the love of Christ. And now I know that I will always be loved and have eternal life with the Lord, knowing that we have a Father in heaven. I live my life now with purpose through worship and a relationship with God. I was never with the Spirit growing up. When I was just 16, I moved away from home to pursue a career in dance. Soon, I started drinking and pursuing a life of excess, which includes substances and sexuality. Then Jesus found me. As I pursued him, he quickly showed me that a life without excess and addiction was within my reach. And now I live my life supported by a foundation of trust in him. I no longer depend on addiction or attraction to find comfort or my ultimate identity because my trust is in Jesus. I was feeling lost and hopeless. I struggled with depression for months because of one overwhelming event after another. Lost and hopeless, I was beginning to doubt that Jesus loved me. Then Jesus showed me that he was present. He showed me through all the prayers that he was there, standing in for me during these difficult times. And now I know through unforeseen miracles that have happened, Jesus still loves me and that I am his child and he will never forsake me nor leave me. My name is Joe and I'm made new because Jesus is alive. My name is Bailey, and I'm made new because Jesus is alive. My name is Judith, and I'm made new because Jesus is alive. My name is Adam, and I'm made new because Jesus is alive. My name is Pamela, and I'm made new because Jesus is alive. <laughs> <laughs>